Now, on that note of COVID, uh, as people are watching at home, we're wearing masks right now. It's definitely changed the landscape of how we conduct all forms of business. Yep. As far as the real estate market is concerned, how has COVID affected what you guys do in regards to showing houses, engaging with people? What does that look like? It's been a really interesting process, actually, and I think it starts with our team. We've got a great staff, and we have uh, you know 32 full-time salespeople that are committed to being as safe as they can uh, just still while doing our jobs. You know, People say, oh, are you an essential service? And really we are, because when COVID lockdown first hit, you have to imagine, you know, we had a bylaw officer attend our office and uh, basically was wondering why we were still open. And I said, well, before the lockdown, you know, we had several transactions with families moving across country, leaving the community, coming into the community and all kind of midstream. So, so you know, obviously our a provincial association got to work very quickly. And now we're at a point where, you know, masks are mandatory, of course, on any indoors. There's no public open houses at this time uh, to try to improve that safety. And as well, the sellers, uh, when you go to look at a house, the seller, it's still their home. Um, if they're prepared to let people in, it's by their rules. Uh, we've set our or as an organization, the minimum standard of two adults per showing only uh, to minimize the number of people in the home. And as well, if the seller adds additional protocols on top, top of that, we support that 100%. And to be honest with you, everybody wants to be as safe as possible. And, it, and it's affected our business, making us much more cognizant of how a showing occurs and how we interact with our clients. Obviously, we still use social media, media video, virtual tours. And with social media and technology, it's made us made it a little bit easier to continue to do that. So, But there's definitely been some challenges uh, along the way. But I, I've said to all my all, all our staff and all of our associates who have been just fantastic, it's a marathon, a and uh, it's a really long marathon, and we haven't won the race yet. And along the way, three things we keep preaching is kindness, compassion, and most of all, patience, because I think people's frustration levels are up, and it's just not as easy as people think to stay calm and patient with the process and being kind, right? So I think that's been our three words we've tried to live by as an office, and it's got us a long way through COVID so far. Day where you're two till it comes where you're at. Or tune in again to the Max City Morning Show. It's so ballistic! Talk about quenching your ugly thirst.